let us see how to solve this question. James invested a sum at 10% compound interest per year for 3 years and received 1331. If he had invested the same amount at 12% simple interest per year for 3 years, what would be the absolute difference in the interest? So in the first case, we are given that John invested a sum P at a compound interest rate of 10% per 3 years and received a total of 1331. So 1331 is nothing but we know that when a sum is invested in compound interest after n years at a rate of r the money becomes p into 1 plus r whole to the power of n. So here the money is given to be 1331 and the rate of interest is given to be 10% and the number of years is given to be 3. So the value of p can be calculated as 1 plus 10 by 100 whole to the power of 3. p into 1.1 whole cube is equal to 1331 and 1.1 whole cube is nothing but 1.331. So the value of P is nothing but thousand dollars. Now in the second case, he is investing the same money at a 12% simple interest for three years. So the interest after three years can be calculated using the formula PTR by 100, which would be equal to thousand into three into 12 divided by 100. That is equal to 360 dollars. In the first case, the total amount that he is receiving is equal to $1331 and the money invested is $1000. So the simple, the compound interest gained in the three years can be calculated as $1331 minus $1000 which is equal to $331. Now we are asked to calculate the absolute difference between the interest and in both the cases. So the difference can be calculated as 360 minus 331 which is equal to 29 plus. So the correct answer is option B.